In this video, we'll be creating the sides and pieces for our box so we can create our automata box. Uh, to begin this, uh, we'll be looking at our box in this orientation when we do create it. So we need to, first we're going to create the bottom and top, they're both the same si size. Uh, then we'll create the two size pieces and then the back piece. Uh, so we're going to invent it and we're going to start a new part. So just new part, standard part. And on this new standard part, we're going to start with the dimensions of the top and bottom, which is just going to be a 5 by 4 rectangle. So, pretty straightforward piece to make. Uh, we're just going to start a 2D sketch. I'm just going to put it on my XY plane, and I'm going to do a rectangle. I'll click on the origin. I want to make it 5 long, and hit tab, 5 forward tall, and enter. Uh, finish my sketch, and then all I have to do is extrude it out a quarter of an inch, 0 0.25 inch. And then I have my Piece. I just need to make it the right material, so I'm going to change it into a uh, wooden material. In this case, I'm just going to change it to a cherry wood. Then I have my piece created. I'm, I'm going to save as, and I'm going to name it top slash top bottom. Then I have that piece created. Next, we want to make our sides. So again, file new. And we're going to do a new part, standard part file, and create. Same basic format. Again, we start a 2D sketch, put on our XY plane, create a rectangle. From the origin, this one's going to be 4 by 4. Finish our sketch. And again, we're going to extrude it out the same 0.25 inch. Again, we want to change our material. So we're going to change it to a cherry wood in this case. And then we have our sides created. Uh, again, we're going to save it. So file save as. And we're going to name this one side. So now we have our sides created. Uh, last, we just need to create the back piece. So to do that, again, we'll start a new project. So new uh, part. Uh, then we're going to start a 2D sketch. X, Y. Uh, this time, again, it's a rectangle starting on our origin. This time it's going to be 4.5 long, so 4.5 by 4, and enter. Finish our sketch, and again extrude it out 0.25 inches, so 0.25. And then change our material again to a wood. So again, same wood material. Uh, it's our last piece created, so we'll file save as, and name it, we'll name it our back. So now we have all the parts we need to create the box. Uh, in our next video, we'll put this box together through an assembly. Uh, hopefully you didn't have much trouble and have these pieces created and made out of the right material.